Hey friends, this is Aisha at Young's Paper Creations. A lovely, lovely uh, day right now. It's stopped snowing outside. I can't see any falling snow. So it's quite uh, white out there. I wanted to... <laughs> I know you're probably wondering, why all these videos? Well, I need to get these out. It's a brand new year and... Uh, I want an opportunity to let you guys see what I have in stock and this is just some of the journals but um, these are more uh, fabrics um, decorated some more than others I wanted to show you the extreme luscious elegance of this one particularly as well so if you like that that's great um, some of the others that I showed recently were, uh, you know, without fabrics and primarily uh, paper ruffles and such. So let me go through again, quick flip through. At some point or another, um, you'll be seeing more, but let's go through this first one here. Hope I'm in frame. If I'm not, I hope I am. Bear with me if I'm not. Let me see. Yeah, I am in frame, but these might be in the way somewhat. Let's see. All right. So again, six by ten and a half. That's the general um, size. Soft cover, one signature. Uh, writing uh, journal great for gratitude journaling and um, you know fate journal anything that you listen once it's in your hands I like to say that once it's in your hands you do as you wish you might just want to make list of things to do goals and such uh, so it's primarily for you to you know it's as the story begins for you to journal your thoughts, your wishes, um, give uh, gratitude and thanks, you know, to God for where he's taking you and where you've been. Having a sense of gratitude and living with a sense of gratitude is something that cannot be beat. It pays its own dividend because where your mind goes and, you know, as whatever is going on in your heart, and mouth so we are so when we journal our blessings and we focus on our blessings we get more of that that's the whole idea okay so again anytime you see pockets or anything like that these are all opportunities for extra writing areas I tried to provide that since that's the whole goal but with that these journals are unique in that they are made with antique vintage papers and not so vintage uh, books and such. Again, more writing opportunities here. Envelopes where you could hide some items. Okay, so this is the first one. And like I said, I could be biased because being the creator of these lovelies, you know, you think the best of them. They are made with love and time. And um, the idea is that when you go to journal, not only are you being able to, you know, write your gratitude listing and such, but you're also able to have your eyes be glanced on, looking at 
taking out the lovelies. So this is what makes these type of journaling books so different from any of the others that you can find that's just blank. This is so lovely. Look at that. I love this. I was hurting, 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 hurting this lovely centerpiece here. And finally, I thought, okay, <laughs> I'll let it go. It's so beautiful. So yes, just lots of opportunities to journal and, you know, imagine having an opportunity to journal all of your grateful, you know, whatever you're grateful for. Okay, love this lovely, lovely, luscious journal. Put this one over here for a minute so that she can have the space all to herself. Again, the sizing, they're all the same. That's why I was not repeating myself. Okay. Again, this is an opportunity for more writing. It's held by this little tie here. So yes, uh, not everyone would, you know, care for the luscious fabrics at the end of the journal, but there's a style for everyone and so that's my job to create journals so that everyone would have their pick. <laughs> I guess there's just something luscious about that. It just reminds you of an outfit of some sort. It's lovely. Decadent is more the word that comes to mind for me. All right. Love this. It's just so luscious. My goodness, it's like a statement piece, having this on your table, and here actually is a, a pocket on the outside. Luscious, luscious. Okay, so this is the last one, and I think I'm, I've gone longer than I intended. That's what you get for showing four journals at a time, right? 
Okay. This one is beautiful. Again, this one too has a pocket. Not as deep as the other one. Just a little bit of fun stuff in the pocket here. It's a deep pocket. I'm going to put that back later. This is some a fabric flip. Another flip. These are just embellishments. Love that. Love this. Paper ruffles. This is just clipped in, so you could take that out to use. Again, these are all opportunities for journaling. flower And there we have it and yes I believe we've gone over our time I hope you enjoyed this opportunity of seeing these beautiful luscious journals and yes they are different from the other um, the others that we had the first ones that you saw but um, those are the styles so there are some without, you know, the fabric, some with a little bit of fabric. And then we have these luscious, luscious ladies that just wants to get all of the attention. And this is what I have. Um, I think that's going to be enough of <laughs> the journal flip throughs for today. Um, more so what I will be doing over the next set of days is probably... Um, just doing my journaling of my gratitude and I will be doing that whether mornings or afternoon but I my aim is to do my gratitude journaling every day all right so I bring you along on the journey and I pray that I'm able to inspire you to just start journaling your gratitude and see where it takes you God bless and keep you if you want to get a hold of me for any of these journals, Young's Paper Creations on YouTube, email me at youngspapercreations at gmail.com. Find out about the discount so that you can get these in your hands and get more than one so you can bless others. The prices for my journals are ridiculous um, that you can afford and um, you need to contact me so that you can enjoy these lovelies. Take care. Bye-bye.